The overall goal of this procedure is to improve the detection sensitivity of ELISA using electrospun nanofibers. This video demonstrates how to achieve femtomolar detection sensitivity of proteins in 10 microliter of whole blood samples within 30 minutes. In a lab on a disk platform, the centrifugal force is used to transfer the liquid through chambers, and the total process is fully automated. The detection sensitivity could be highly enhanced by the integration of nanofibers. However, the problem was that the nanofiber is very fragile and difficult to handle. In this video, we introduce a simple process to attach fragile titanium dioxide nanofiber mats on a plastic disc. To fabricate titanium dioxide nanofiber mats on silicon substrate by electrospinning, the silicon substrate is first silicized, coated with PDMS, and procured. A nanofiber mat is then transferred to this procured PDMS and this product is punched to produce a circular piece for attachment. Coat the reaction chamber with a drop of PDMS as an adhesive and attach the circular piece to the bottom of the chamber. Then, cure the PDMS in the oven. Finally, assemble the disc layers into one complete device for ELISA. This nanofiber transfer technique allows us to utilize the high surface area of nanofibers for bioanalysis. The centrifugal microfluidic device offers the full integration and automation of all the process required in ELIJA. The main advantage of this technique over other existing methods is that it could detect femtomolar concentrations of proteins from only 10 microliter of whole blood. Prepare the precursor solutions as described in the accompanying test protocol. Then load the solution in the electrospinner and fabricate the nanofibers by electrospinning using the optimal conditions.